What's up boys and girls, it's your boy Tech Rods and I'm back with some Madden 16 Ultimate Team news. And specifically this week, EA has been releasing what legends we are going to have at launch. So let's get right into it. So the first one is John Elway. And what I like is with these legends is they're showing you exactly what year they were featured uh, as far as like the card goes. So this John Elway is from 1993 and he's a 93 overall. You're not gonna see the stats on the screen. You can only use the reveal tool to actually find them, but several people have already found them. So key stats, he's gonna have 96 throw power, 96 throw accuracy, 93 throw accuracy short, 92 throw mid, 95 throw deep. And as far as speed, he's gonna have 76. Uh, which I think is kind of underselling a bit because John Elway was always pretty crafty, pretty fast. The second person they revealed is also from the Broncos, it's Terrell Davis, and it's from the 1997 season, and he's a 94 overall, pretty beastly there. He has 93 speed, 94 acceleration, 92 awareness, 90 agility, and then he has 95 trucking as well as 92 juke move, 90 ball kill vision, and 92 stiff arm. And then uh, moving right along, uh, right after that, uh, following kind of the theme of Broncos players, but this specific one is from the 2000 se season. It's Shannon Sharp uh, from when he was a Raven. Uh, that's when they went to the Super Bowl. He's actually a 92 overall. Shannon Sharp was one of the better tight ends, I think, as far as legends before the Ultimate uh, Legends actually came out. He has 87 speed, 90 acceleration, 96 catch, 90 release, 87 route running and then 96 catch in traffic so it looks like we're still going to be following on the trend of him being a pretty beast tight end um, then uh after that we actually have joe horn of the new orleans saints which i think it's pretty awesome because if you remember joe horn was that wide receiver that scored a touchdown and had hidden a cell phone a flip cell phone inside the goal poles and pulled it out he actually got fined for that um but anyway this card is 92 speed 92 jump 95 catch 91 release 97 catch in traffic 92 juke move and then 93 spec catch I'm surprised they actually gave Joe Horn a legend card because I wouldn't really even call Joe Horn a legend. So this was a little surprising to me, but you know what, whatever, we'll take it. Uh, after that, they actually did drop a Dermonte Dawson. He's a pretty beast Steelers uh, center for back in the day. This one's from 1996. And I mean, I. We've had a Dermonte Dawson before, I think in Madden Ultimate Team. This one has 95 run block, 96 run block strength, 94 run block footwork, which I'm wondering if that's even gonna matter because I don't think that actually mattered in Madden Pass. And then he has 95 impact block, 91 uh, pass block strength, and then 90 just pass block overall. So we'll see how that actually plays into it. He also has 93 strength, which is pretty good. Finally, as far as the ones that were revealed, is John Randall. We also had a John Randall last year. This one is a 93 overall from 1994. Uh, he has 90 strength, 91 power move, 90 block shed, 90 pursuit, 96 finesse move. So pretty beast for whenever they came out. I mean, were legends at the beginning of Madden 15 this, this good? Because I feel like these ones are pretty legit. But I wonder how we're gonna be able to have access to them. Are they gonna be sets? Are they gonna be released all right away? We'll see. Now, just uh, for, for kicks, I, I showed, I'm showing you this right here because it's a fullback that they're showing us. It's a red card. And if you go back to one of my old videos where I say the top couple running backs that I want, I really think this is Christian Okoye. And if this is Christian Okoye, I'm telling you right now, I'm going to sell the farm and try to get this card at fullback because he was amazing. But anyway, go and head on over to Madden Ultimate Teams. Twitter page, official Twitter page, which I'll also give you a link in the description below. They're actually revealing all these legends, and what they're doing is they'll give you a card like the one that you see on your screen right now. They ask for a certain amount of retweets, and when they get those retweets, they actually go ahead and reveal the card. But I really think this is Christian Okoye. Anyway, tell me what you think about these legends. 
Are you disappointed by any of them? Are there any other legends you want to see? Make sure that you're going to the Mutthead site and you're using their Mutt16 ratings reveal tool because you can actually see all of them. And then let me know which ones you've actually revealed already. Go ahead and share them to me. And make sure that you are uh, going to all of my social media pages and interacting with me. Go to my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram, all those great things because that's why I want to see from you guys. I want to be interacting with you. Remember, we're going to have a lot of Mutt16 content as well as just regular Madden 16 content, and I want it to be driven by you guys. But anyway, like if you like the content, you want to see more Mutt16 content, make sure you subscribe if you're new, but most importantly, take care of yourself. It, but we're not gonna panic. We're not gonna panic. We're gonna truck through somebody and any Lacey's off to races. You know, we could turn on the Jets, but nah. What where's that stiff arm? Where's that stiff arm? Eddie Lacey is body we that we weren't gonna be able to use him for the rest of the game. First and goal, I get hit in the backfield, stagger away, but I still able to keep my footing and I run in for a touchdown.